bites, pink bites, good food on my mind. Pink bites, pink bites, for breakfast, lunch, or dinner time. Yo, 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 what's up everybody? So this is the first installment of Bink Bites, positive food experiences. And I definitely had a positive food experience at this place inside the Cosmopolitan a few days ago. It's called Henry's and it's literally right next to Las Vegas Boulevard. You walk in the door, make a right, boom, it's right there. And oh my God, these great... <laughs> Not a selfie. <laughs> literally this meal though was the inspiration behind me wanting to start Bink Bites. I eat great food all over the place, all over the time, and I was like, you know what, let me just start it with this one. So I'm gonna take you in here, I'm gonna show you what it looks like, I'm gonna tell you the ingredients, I'm gonna record my first bite, which really doesn't matter if it was my first or the 23rd bite. Uh, it would have been just as amazing. So um, yeah, check this out. It has arrived. <laughs> oh my god. It even comes in this cute little like egg dish. So those are the eggs, obviously, on top of the braised short rib, on top of the hash browns, in this special sauce with the hollandaise on top. This is phenomenal. Alright, so I'm about to have my first bite. First. <laughs> Every single bite is incredible. I wish I could hold it while you could see the eggs burst. Oh, oh. See the key though, guys? You gotta get a little bit of the short rib, a little bit of the egg, and a little bit of the, the hash brown. You know when something's just so good, you gotta point at it? That's what a bink bite is. When you just point at it, it's so good. Oh, dude. I get so excited for food, really. Every time it's like, cool. Lost a little. Oh, I'm looking around like I want to tell someone about it. It's so good. Oh my God. It's like I really don't want it to end. I really don't. Oh my God. You know what I just realized? I didn't put black pepper on it. You gotta put the fresh black pepper. Oh. You guys. All the flavors in this just, like the creaminess of the egg and then the starchiness of the potatoes, but like the acidity of whatever this sauce is at the bottom. Oh, it can't get better than this, I don't think, for an Eggs Benedict. If you like braised short ribs and you like eggs, whoa, Henry's. Actually, I did it again. The Henry at the Cosmopolitan. Come check it out. Last bite. So as a recommendation, maybe we should get some bread to like soak up the extra stuff because you don't want to waste it. You know, like, look at all this goodness. Appreciate it, bud. Thank you. Yeah. All right, so final thoughts there. That dish is decadent. It's like a delicacy. Um, that's how the, the bartender just described it because I came in here starving, and I'm not starving anymore, but I'm definitely not satisfied. So you might want to get like a pancake on the side or something, you know, <laughs> because uh, although that's a great dish, it's not too filling. Big bun, Cosmo. Big bun. Good food on my mind.